right, in this Unity tutorial, I'm going to go over another physics joint called the character joint, I think it is called. Yes, the character joint. So let me start a new project. And I'll call this one the character joint. OK, now I'm going to add some uh, game object here, cube. You move up a little. I'm going to put a rigid body on that. Boom. And then I'm going to duplicate, Control D, and then, OK, select and Control D. And then the duplicate, just move it down. All. Oh. OK. There, I moved it down. Now, for the first one, I'm going to add the character joint. Here it is. Boom. And then I'll give it, for the rigid body, the second cube. So now just with these things connected like this, if I, let me say main camera, control shift F. With these things connected here like this, if I just say play, oh, they both fell. I always forget this every tutorial. Turn off the gravity on the first body. First body will just stay right there. There we go. Nothing's happening. But the thing is, if I pick the second one here and kind of knock it around a little bit, you can see it's like hanging from there and it has rotations and it swings in three directions unlike the hinge joint which just swings in one direction because the character joint you actually have angular limits on each axis that you could set all right so now the question is what is this like if i do it on an actual character like a body of some type so let me make a character If I move the chest, which is everything is the root of all my connections, there you go. Kind of moves like arms and legs swinging around. Interesting, isn't it? So that's the character joint.